Hi, this is Martha coming to you uh, as I join in with Melissa over at Moe's Creations as she is sponsoring a challenge that is called Hashtag HL Challenge with Mo. And in this challenge, we are to use those products that we purchased um, in the clearance sales, but we have never used. There will be others who are participating, and you can find their videos by doing a search on this title. Hashtag HL Challenge with Mo. Uh, Mo uh, Melissa is such a wonderful card maker, so be sure to challenge uh, to check her out as well. In this one, the products I use that I did not, uh, the additional products are... I used this butterfly, and I just got this at an estate sale. And I'm going to show do a haul video later on today that I hope to upload tomorrow. Please check that out, because there are some beautiful things in there. And I give you the history behind these. Anyway, I got this butterfly die for $3. And I do, I try to stock up on any safari-related um, items, because my son-in-law sponsors a safari every two years. And I want to be on the ready in case I need to make something for him. So this is one die that I used. And I used a second one. But I have spent an hour looking for that die. And I cannot find it. Anyway, alright. Here is one of my clearance items that I uh, got. It was $14.99 marked down to $3.74. And my favorite... Oh, I can't wait to show you these cards. Uh, this one. Uh, okay. I'll show you my Safari one first. This is that background I just showed you. And then that uh, other Safari die. And this is the die that is hiding. I cannot find this die. And as you can see, it is so special. <laughs> I have got to locate it. And this was... um. A stamp. I got these from uh, Create and Craft, oh, about four years ago. But anyway, that's my first card using that background. But, oh, wait till you see this. Oh, my goodness. This is using the leaf background and that butterfly. Oh, my gosh, I love that. Um, my friend Anita bought this, uh, what is it called, window paper when she was on a trip and I just so I cut the butterfly out of that paper so it would be very colorful and I've got them layered up so that it stands off the paper and then I ended up with a another black cut out just of the outline of the butterfly that stands up and I have just been staring at this card and the next one I absolutely love them and here's my fall one Look at those colors in that butterfly. Oh, I love this card. I love it, love it, love it. And, oh, and on the inside, I put this uh, sentiment. And uh, again, the same way. I, I layered it. I first tried to use the double-sided adhesive uh, paper, but it really didn't stick. So I ended up having to use my liquid glue on these. Okay, I am, like I said, so excited over these cards. I just think they're so colorful, and I love them. I think they're in my top five of all the cards I've ever created, these two. All right, thank you so much for watching. Check out all the other participants. Thank you for subscribing. Be sure to come back tomorrow and look for my haul video. Thanks for subscribing. Be blessed. Stay safe, and ta-da.